We're starting today here in Fairfax and right across the street you see all that construction. What they're doing right now is tearing down the high school that I went to. Which was a really, really old school called Paul VI. And they're building it into this huge condo complex. But they're keeping the front section of the school. So what do you think? Let me know in the comments. Would you want to live in your old high school that's been retransformed? Retransformed. Retransformed into condos. This place right here has been a couple different supermarkets in its lifetime, and now it's called Ranch Market. There's a grand opening sign on there. I think there's a food court maybe inside. So let's go check it out. They always have all sorts of cool items at these Asian grocery stores, like all this different variety of seaweed. This is all seaweed right here. They have the Eat Up Eatery here in the grocery store and there are like five or six different stands plus you've got the regular grocery store type of stands. Some of them are closed right now so I think they'll maybe open up later so we'll definitely come back here and check it out when everything is up and running fully. Better not steal, you'll get your picture up on the exit door. Went in there to just check out the uh, food court area and ended up getting a few different snacks. Uh, Japanese fried chicken sauce that has apparently frozen and stuck to my trunk and might be here forever. All right, first up, what I'm most excited about are these bad boys. Triple M sticks, and this one is called grilled squid flavor. So they are individually wrapped. Seaweed stick for sure. I always love seaweed snacks. I don't know if it's giving me the grilled squid taste. And I would definitely get this again. Next up are these shrimp chips. Wasabi flavored. Grab a quick handful here. Your regular type of shrimp chips, but I really do like the wasabi flavor. I could eat this whole bag right now. But we have lunch planned. Finally, something I've never heard of. Salt and vinegar fish crackers. Not a cartoon fish, a real live actual fish. and I can't even open it. All right, outside it's like 30 something degrees <sighs> and my fingers are frozen and I cannot open this bag and now they are freaking throbbing in pain. I'm about to pop this bag open from the bottom. What the heck, man? <gasps> I can't even pop it. Oh my gosh, freaking, it didn't pop. This bag is indestructible. Uh, and then it tears right away. These are basically similar to the shrimp chips. And having them salt and vinegar flavored is very odd. It actually tastes a little bit like pickles. It was no surprise that the fish chips put up the biggest fight out of all these. And I think I know why. They don't want you to open them because they don't want you to taste them. They were horrific. On DMV Adventures, we don't often return to the same place twice, let alone so close to each other. But today we're back at Bebop Korean Mexican here in Fairfax. We had the tacos before, but today I want to try their bulgogi hamburger. Just placed my order and every single seat in the restaurant, it's pretty small, but they were all taken and that's a good sign. And we don't want to make this the exact same video as the last time we went there, but there's no way I'm coming to this shopping center here across from Paul the Six and at least getting a bunch of delicious donuts for later. I love that they put them in a pizza box. You're telling me I gotta look at this and smell it. It's coming right up into my nose and I'm not allowed to eat it until after lunch. Come on. All right, we've got our real lunch right here. So this is the hamburger everybody's been talking about in Fairfax. It's the bulgogi burger. 
It's got Swiss cheese, onion, and lettuce on it. And I told them no mayo because that's the rules. And now it's time to take our first bite. <laughs> that is awesome. That's what happens when the food turns you into Ric Flair. Woo! I just love the bulgogi seasoning and marinade and all that stuff coming together right here. Like a regular hamburger, but like up a notch, a little more desserty tasting. Cause this is a unique, unique, unique flavor and taste for a burger. And this is absolute madness. It's just like when you order a chili fries or something like that. It's like, how am I supposed to eat this? I guess with a fork. I took one bite. It's awesome. This is amazing. I like that both the burger and the fries, their natural cheese is not some nasty, nasty, nasty American cheese like most places. Burger gets Swiss on it and the fries get like a mozzarella parmesan mix. Mad respect to places that don't use American cheese. So stop what you're doing when you're in Fairfax and check out the Bebop Korean Mexican Grill. This is already shot up as one of the best burgers in Fairfax. Try out one of their bulgogi items. Let me know what you think about it. And as always, thank you for joining me here in Fairfax and I look forward to seeing you on my next DMV adventure.